Hey, this is Uncle Mark in the mothership with a three-string cigar box guitar. Yeah, yeah. Playing through my uh, vintage 47 amp here. Um, all I have is a little bit of reverb and uh, fairly clean tone. It's a dirty amp, so uh, nothing is completely clean coming out of it. But this is a clean tone and... Uh, so uh, what I wanted to do today was do uh, just the just the camera a little bit. What I wanted to do today was uh, let it be. Um, I've had a bunch of requests after I did a little let it be thing. Uh, so uh, let's play some let it be. Um, easy song. Shapes can be challenging. So uh, this is how I do it. get started with this thing so let's go through some of the fundamentals um, at the zero fret G D G G chord G sharp a B flat B C C sharp D D sharp E F important F sharp G so the song is in C I like to play my G here as opposed to open because I'm right here I can just move my finger to this G, and then I just put my third finger on the D and my pinky on the D. And that way I can get to the A really easily. And then I can go G, F. So the song goes C, G, A, G, F, C, G. certainly do a C, C to G, to A, to F, okay, you can certainly do that, that's totally cool, and there's nothing in the world wrong with it, I'm just a big fan of this shape, and I like sliding it around, um, so that's just me, I just like sliding this shape around, it's a really good lesson, it helps me in how I think of the cigar box guitar. 
So I think of this shape and this shape, and that's the only things I think about. I, I don't think about any other shapes. That, and that's just your personal preference, so you can certainly see G, A, F, C, G, F, C. Okay? It's your personal preference, you know? Whatever you want to do. Um, I think it's a lot more work to work up and down the neck, but you know what? It's your playing that is important, not mine. I'm just here to show you the paths and open the doors a little bit, and you know, you swing them open and do what you want to do. Um, so the chorus part, the let it be, let it be, let it be, yeah, let it be. So it's a uh, C. Let it be. Okay, so um, hang on. Where am I at? Whisper words of wisdom, let it be. A, let it be. G, let it be. F, let it be. Yeah, C, let it be. Yeah, whisper words, G, wisdom. F, let it be. Let it be. You can do your A here, G. You can do your F. little trick where I came all the way up here to F with octaves and went okay so here I am on C and I know that this dot means it's E so these dots are B flat C D and E okay so I know that that's an F so with my finger already here, I slide up to that F and put my first finger down. At this point, I am actually hitting this note. I am doing the extra credit walking on top of this one and playing that note too. So I'm playing two notes as opposed to a chord, okay? But since I'm muting, this D string, I can strum it. I really think this is a great opportunity to go through this kind of, you're putting your first finger here and your second finger there and you are gonna come across this D string. And you can strum your octaves. great technique for a guitar strung this way. It's, it's a fantastic technique that you should be knowing or at least sometimes using to great effect. People love it in the bar, you know, and uh, they'll love it around the campfire. So what I'm doing is, so I'm on F here. C, I slide all the way up again, put my finger down, and I'm crossing over my D string. So, F, E, D, C, B, A, G, F, C. fun it's a fun little tool um, for those who want to get a little more advanced you can do the uh, when the broken hearted people and you can just do that your your downward progression remember I think of guitars as a ladder climbing up the ladder, you're going down the ladder. I think of guitars as a ladder, you're going and down, you're walking down the ladder. F, E, D, C. So, um... way to 
play this. Um, it's a fairly easy song. It's a C, it's a G, it's an A, G, F. Um, I think you all can can map that out um, and any way you map it out is a good way for you um, I like my way just because I like my way um, But that's not the only way and I want you to be able to play it differently by the way the reason I like these chords is because if I want to play this song in D all I do is move my hand Find myself in times of Slide everything up. Find myself in times of trouble. Mother Mary comes to me. No, I just changed, I completely changed the song to F. That's why I like these chords, is so I can just maneuver around the neck really easily and change keys at, at my own liberty. Um, so, if you like that, that's great. If not, good. Play it in C. That's the, that's the way the song is. It's a piano song and it's played in C. Um, so, this is how I do it. Um, thank you all so much for all that you do for me. I do have a donate link down below. It's a paypal.me forward slash Uncle Mark Tips. Thank you for all you donators, um, big and small. I thank you all, all the same. Thank you. You're wonderful. And uh, thanks for sharing on social media, getting the word out. That's a really big deal. Um, so thank you, letting everyone know that, you know, this site is available and uh, I'm here to help. And uh, so uh, thank you so much. We'll see you another time.